I don't know if this warehouse is designed the same way or same layout as the other one. It might be similar though. That thing's following me. I'll just leave him alone. Let him scuttle around there. Got some soda. Some diabetes right there. What is this? Got a handgun burst fire. Oh, there goes the lights. I guess I don't need the flashlight no more. Got morphine, anti-venom, and survival guide. There's another junction box there. I'll fix it. Have Carter do all the work. Yeah, it's done something upstairs. Got FL darts. Darts. Is that for the arrow or what? Hmm. Probably use his food on Blake. There you go. Things in my way. I'll just kill it. Yeah, it's one little guy. Wow, that was a lot of damage. Whoever did that, I think that was the crossbow. Congratulations. I applaud you for that. There's a dead guy here. Aw, oh, man. Oh, there goes that. At least that crowbar lasted a lot longer than the first one. I think the first one only lasted two tries. It's empty fridges. Got a reflex stem, some food. Endurance stem, morphine. And that's it. How many blood packs do I have? Yeah, one. I think I saw a crowbar down here. Yeah, there is another one over there. Let me just grab that. It's mine. Got a flare gun. Come down here. Just chase me over here so you can play here by yourself. Yeah, just chill over there by the table. Some more corpses there. What? What is over here? There's a guy there. Is he friendly? Probably a research guy. I thought I could hide. Oh, he's hostile. He's probably paranoid. Oh, he took two shots at me. Jerk. He gave me some ammo, though. Is that a crate? I got two Molotovs. And a lightweight helmet. Who doesn't have a helmet? Oh, he already has a helmet. Never mind. Probably give it to Webster. Oh, I got two helmets. This one's a lot more better. Look at that. Oh, this one decreases your evasiveness for some reason. Oh, it's medium armor. Now, I think only this guy has... I forgot who has medium ar armor proficiency. I forgot what, who it was. I think she has the do-rag. Okay, I should probably add another guy to my team right now. But... Yeah, fill up this empty slot. Question is who, though? Should I do it? Sure, why not? Give him this helmet. Give him this armor. What should you have? Probably the medical mask. Probably give you another melee weapon. Yeah, this spike maul, why not? That's all I could do for him. This defense sucks though, man. What 
remember what happens if I give a weld in the research outfit? Would that help him? I'll decrease my health. Decreases my defense. Nah. Probably stick with his regular outfit. Yeah, hopefully I don't have to fight a huge monster boss here in this warehouse. Because I just finished fighting another guy, Mr. 42 Beta. He was a jerk. There's more supplies there. More dead bodies. Yeah, there's that menacing looking door. Reminds me of Doom. I got arrows. What's with all these arrows? Oh shit. At least they had the common courtesy to let me run away. Damn things hiding in the boxes and shit. Yeah, these things just pop out at random. Area secure, are you sure about that, North? Yeah, look at that, come on. I'm just releasing all these menacing creatures out. It's all these darts I'm getting. There's nothing in the toilet. Nobody tried to flush down any drugs in there I can use. I got an energy drink, stim. I got adrenaline, I got more energy stim. What the hell is this energy stim anyways? Since I'm getting a lot of it. Where is it at? Oh, right there. Experimental 30% SP cap. Huh. Well, I know that thing's temporary. It won't last forever, so... Probably use it in emergencies or something. Should probably go upstairs and fix the terminal. Well, look at that shallow depth of field. Very blurry. Pretty cool. See what's on this side. Yeah, I can see everything down. Well, up here, I mean. Some broken stuff. It looks like a jacket. And a flare gun and some flares and ammo. Got a lot of flare guns now. What's this? Who the hell keeps shotgun shells on the roof? I have no idea. I don't think that's a. I don't think I have a Jenny gump jumpsuit yet. Oh shit. Eh. Not really impressive, but I'll just pass on that. I'll stick with the uh, default rescue outfit. Probably heal Parker. Where's this terminal at? It's probably down here. 
Oh, there's someone chilling here. Who's this? Probably another hostile. But at least they don't, like, straight up attack me. I can just run past them and get all this stuff. Got bandages. Yeah, bandages are pretty useful for the bleeding out ailment. Spec Ops training. Where's that at? Agility. What should I give it to? Oh, Blake, of course. Why not give it to the main character? Oh, yeah, I forgot the stuff does not stack. I probably wasted that one. Yeah, I probably wasted it on Blake. I'm pretty sure I gave him when the start of the game. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, I have morphine. What the hell? I forgot I have morphine. I have three. Probably should have used that on Carter right at the beginning. I'll let Blake since... No, oh, he's fine. Oh, I didn't get rid of it. Oh, well, he's a small percentage. He doesn't get rid of it. Well, let's talk to this random dude. Shit, where did you come from? The fucking mess out here. Oh, okay. Join me. I don't have many other options. Sure, I'll come with you. Oh, a random dude joins my party. Huh, his name is Guy. He's rank 4 though, he's an engineer, so... I guess this is kind of like the game helping you out just in case you lose all your engineers when you reach this point of the game. Just a random NPC. But I'll leave him on the, on the sidelines for now. Oh, what the hell, what's this? A tomahawk. Instructions, let's see. In the 4x4 grid, each letter is worth a number. A is 1, D is 4, and yeah, okay. You must make the entire total of the grid add up to 40. Each time you step on a tile, it will change letter. Once you have a total of 40, return to the CPU terminal. Right. So I just got to make everything add up. So that's all 1. So I guess I have to step on it multiple times. Let me just make this all equal to four. Same thing for down here. I just step on it randomly. Okay, how much does that equal? I got. Oh crap, I way overshot that. So I need to get four, right? How about that? Okay, I need to get rid of one. That should do it. There. Find a way into the secured room complete. Enter the submersible. Okay, I managed to do that. I didn't take that long on it. Now let's go downstairs. I'm guessing that unlocks the big menacing looking door down there. Surprised there's no safety rails on this. Looks like you can easily fall off to your death. Oh, that thing managed to walk all the way up here. Or maybe it came out of the door. Yeah, there's like things running all over the place. Ah, there's a guy up there. But a junction box probably fixed that. Fight Webster. I know what we're doing. Sort of. What is that? It's a security key card number two. Bunch of blood here. Is that ammo? Yep, handgun ammo. That's pretty neat. Oh, 
Well, that sucks when all of them were empty. Let me save. Every time I see those, I just save automatically. It's instinct. Who's this guy? Right. You were one of Colin's men, right? Yeah, didn't get very far in terms of escaping this mess. Uh, I forgot. He was the third team. I forgot which team there was. He joined me. I'm sorry, I can't go anywhere. Just leave me. Why? Well, I don't want to coerce him because I don't want him backstabbing me later on. Yeah, it stays the same thing. I'll come back for you later. Might need to give him something. Usually, when they refuse to offer, you have to trade something in return so you can get them to follow you. Bunch of random items in here. Some machine gun ammo. Bandages. What's this? Elevator floor. Oh, it's all the floor information. So warehouse, security, data storage, test lab, H5, holding cells, quarantine cells, quarantine, and wait, what? Pressure room. I'm going to go to security because I imagine security might hold some weapons I can use. Very shaky elevator. There's a bunch of things here, though. Well, I guess I have to fight. Fight or fly. Let me give Carter to the flare gun. Yeah, these things. I got enough flares anyways. There's more machine gun ammo. I could probably use that. Damn it. Like, why is everything like popping out? It's either rewarding me or punishing me. Yeah, half the time I don't even want to bother opening those crates. Got advanced med kit. I got rewarded at least. A lot of empty though. I should probably turn on my flashlight. I forgot about that. This is no more light. Nitrogen grenade. I think that's supposed to freeze. Well, a lot of nitrogen grenades. The hell? Looks like I need an access code. Looks like I need an access code. I like doing that for some reason. I don't know. His voice. I find his voice funny for some reason. It's like the tough guy voice. Those guys are just like partying in there. Luckily, there's another entrance here. It's here. More machine gun ammo. Accuracy stim. Yeah, those things are going to corner me. Those things are weird. It's like crawling on his butt. Kind of reminds me of a dog when he tries to take crap and he doesn't finish. Oh shit, I didn't even pay attention to Blake's health. Probably use a bandage on him since he's bleeding out. Got plenty of bandages. Yeah, I can't have Blake die or else I'm gonna lose the game. Bunch of misses. It didn't heal Blake's is uh bleeding out though, that sucks. Stop missing people, come on. Doing pretty bad now. Yeah, like Parker's always missing, like how's that thing missing? Am I getting a lot of experience? That thing's gonna go straight after me. These things just love being around me.
Guess when they have broken bones, it might affect their accuracy because, I don't know, maybe broken arm or something? That might make sense. That wasn't too bad. It looks like a dead animal. Probably is a dog or something. Make sure I didn't leave anything behind. Pretty sure that gate over there is locked. Looks like I need another goddamn key. Looks like I need another goddamn key. Yeah, goddamn key. Could probably missed something in these blood piles because there's like random items on the floor. Usually key cards or keys or some stuff like that. I need an access code for that. I'm not sure where to get those. Yeah, that looks like a dead dog. So nothing on that floor. How's my team doing? Blake's kind of messed up. Hopefully this bandage will heal him. Okay, there you go. That's better. So number five was data storage, right? I'm just going to go down in order. Oh, shit. Yeah, I kind of messed up there. Number five, I meant. Yeah, there's something there. Yeah, I'll switch out Carter's flare gun. I don't want to waste too much. Yeah, I just saved it for those little crawl uh, thing. Chest bursters. I'm not sure what the right term to call them. Damn, three of them? It's always a problem when they're in large groups, though. Oh, he poisoned me, that jerk. That's one down. Come on, team. Hit your marks. Uh, let's see. I'll probably use more bandages on him. Almost got lucky in that one shot. It's kind of weird how it's so easy for them to put status effects on it. It takes one turn. Usually if you try to heal a wound, the next turn they just give it right back at you. It's a little bit too quick on that though. Blake's leveled up. Yeah, I think the game gives the status fix way too quickly, too easily. Yeah, you constantly have to heal all the time. Like, look at Parker. <laughs> eh, I think I got anti-venom on me. Yeah, I do got two of them. Alright, 